guys, Harley from Vitmill with Kev. We've, last year when we went to the Expo in May, we came back and did a flavour testing of everything that we'd got. I think the first one I ever did was that and I've done my own. Today we're doing the same, uncut of all the flavours we've got uh, and there's two disposable pods as well so we're going to try them and just do a quick uncut review. So first off we've got Crunchies. First one is custard cream. If you don't have one of these before, guys, you literally just snap it in half and then pour it on. It can be a bit fiddly. Squeeze it out a bit. Drip it on. They're not the best, are they? Nope. Very prominent flavour, bro. <coughs> Custard cream, that is pretty, very prominent. Face to my coffee. <coughs> yeah, it has got a coffee tinge to it, hasn't it? Yeah. Turn my light on so I ain't got a dark side. I've got less, less of a dark side. Second one is Coco Bourbon. I like a good Bourbon flavour. Well, I like a Bourbon, shall I say. So my foot, show my flavour's gone. I'm not a fan of having to set my cap off every time. No, not with them. Pour it on. Not the best flavour neither of them. No, I think the uh, last one was quite nice. But I don't like coffee. That tastes like a bourbon. Bourbon biscuit. And the upside is if you've still got the coffee flavour in, then it'll make it matter for bourbon and coffee. Yeah. <laughs> Not overly really fond of them. Can you set pure VG? I won't rush out to go and buy them. Bit of pure VG just to get a bit of flavour off them over dripped a bit. The next one is Ginger Snaps. <clears throat> Very spicy. Gingerbread's quite spicy, isn't it? I don't like ginger. <laughs> so you're doing quite well in this review, then. So far, yeah. Coffee and ginger. Yeah, brilliant. We are doing well. It smells of ginger. No. Great. That is just herbally spicy ginger. Do you want a problem with that? It's going to taint liquids. That's horrible. No. If you like ginger, it's probably nice, but you've got to be a big ginger fan. That is definitely going to taint my tank. Luckily, the taste don't last long. <clears throat> right, so next one we've got Air Factory Strawberry and Kiwi. There's a lot of strawberry and kiwi flavours knocking about. And they're usually quite good. It's gone too bad, surely. Not the best strawberry and kiwi I've had, but it's quite nice. Mm. Can you see us? <laughs> Hello! Mm. Better than the other lot. Yeah, it's not the best strawberry and kiwi, no. though, is it? Don't come in. Are you going? No. 
not bad, Mucky. You. Okay. All right. I've done the daftiest trick ever. What? What, Miss Anatomy Go? <laughs> <laughs> nice one. I'm not going to cut it. I'm just going to pause it, and then we'll carry on again in a minute. So, as soon as I uh, <coughs> pause the recording, he went, "Oh, I'll go in. Sorry," and went, and then I some trick or treaters in. But anyway, like I say, it's long cut. We just um, had a quick pause. This one is Cookie Crunch. So I'm glad that they're all. I'm fed up with doing the uh, sample sashi. It's a nightmare. It's a bit naff to be fair. Nice. No naff. <coughs> it does taste like cookie, but it's very. Um, it's not very prominent. Especially compared to the first flavour we tried, that had a lot of flavour. Well, we're doing well so far. I haven't liked <laughs> any of them. <laughs> so next we've got Sherbet Kiss. Blackcurrant Lemon Sherbet. by someone you realize know, kissing obviously mm -hmm. I wonder why that steam works or something is it I think it was it smells strong Very black currant, it tastes like a sweet. That's nice. <coughs> it's black currant and it's prominent. Mm. What more can you ask for? Oh, we did have some other flavours that somebody asked me to review. Obviously, no one's asked me to review because we're just doing them. And I saved that bunch for a review next week. And I'm quite glad I did because there's still a lot of flavours. <clears throat> I don't know where the lemon is in that. No, I can't have I had a lot of black crew and didn't have any lemon. Put that back in The next one is Purple Kiss Fizzy Wild Berries. And there's the bottle. I don't know, but a lot of these have uh, got nicotine in as well, so we having quite a bit of nicotine. Yeah. That tastes like the job you know polos used to get, but uh, fruit flavours, so there's different flavour in each one. That tastes a little bit like them. Not the most prominent flavour, but it's alright. <coughs> no, not as good as the first one. <coughs> the warm. Next we've got Mellow Buddha. Nirvan. Yeah, again, three milligram. Mellow but in Nirvana. I think I've tried these before. Might have missed on the last expo review. Might have done. Not very proud, a little bit cakey. A little bit, no. I don't got much flavour. <clears throat> Another Mellow Buddha Zen Master. That's the box. 
And that's the beaver. That's my second fire alarm. I've took this one down. Let me just go so that one out. <coughs> this one's going well. It's that vape in here that the fire alarm from the next room is going off. Ah. So like I said, this is Zen Zen Master by Mellow Butter. We were quite a bit of fire by then. That was more fruity, but it's still not the most prominent flavor we've tried. Now, none of them seem to have much flavor. Show a bit of burn off. Alright, now we've got two by strapped. <clears throat> Get them looking good. Strapped are always at the expos. We've got cool lemon sherbet first. <clears throat> do, 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 do. Should be alright because I bought some. Kev bought some. So he's obviously tried this level before. No, I got the great. Oh, Kev bought the great version. He didn't buy this one. Mm. It's not mentally per se, but there's quite a cool hair back here throughout. Other than that, it's not prominent at all. No, it's nice and great. <laughs> <laughs> the great one's nice. Bubblegum drumstick. Let's <coughs> get a quick look in. I can smell it. That's not very uh, prominent, but you can taste bubblegum and you can taste the um, drumstick. So not kicking your face uh, flavour for some more, is it? No. <sighs> right, so we've got Naked Fish Bakuda. Barracuda, <coughs> yes, that's how it's more sense. Barracuda, Naked Fish. <clears throat> Do, 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 do. It smells quite watermelony. Not water. Our watermelony or cucumber. Definitely about melon there. Yeah. Let's see. Ooh. <coughs> Not bad. Naked fish prana. <coughs> Dropped it. <coughs> Naked fish prana. Oof. There is so much nicotine in my system right now. Yeah. It's not a horrible flavour, but it's not my kind of flavour. <coughs> <coughs> I 
<coughs> not tasting much flavour at all now. It's a really soft, cakey flavour. Let's have another blow off. <coughs> this flavour test is really pushing me to my limit. Yeah. Not only that, I had a lot of nicotine before we started as well, so this is just constant 3 milligrams. And a lot of. So the last liquid we've got is steam. Heisenberg, yeah, again, three milligram. <clears throat> do, 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 do. Oh, I'm missing three flavors. No, I'm missing one flavor. Two, yeah. or is it three? <laughs> Are you? Yeah, steam gives us some more. It's Eisenberg, what can you say? It's literally Eisenberg. Back in a minute. Mm. Some more by steam. That's three boxes of Glamp Cam. Glamp. Glam Cam. I don't know if I haven't really got much to it to be fair. In fact, that's 6 milligram. <coughs> what flavour is it supposed to be? Don't say. Mm. <coughs> that's a bit null and void. Now we've got a disposable pod by Woohoo! In this one that you tried. Yeah, tobacco. Tobacco is not that good. <laughs> no, that's. It doesn't really get much vapor, no flavour, but there is a slight hint of tobacco. more. Try these guys that did jumps on their uh, video things we were doing. This is another disposable pod. Flame. Don't, don't know what flavour that's supposed to be, but meant for the Kev Travel Visa makes for as well. Okay, bottom cap. Okay, top cap. It's oh, I can't remember if it's mango or mango, mentally mango, cold, cold mango type thing. <clears throat> yeah, not very nice. I think it's alright for a disposable pod. Um, <clears throat> right guys, there you go. Sorry it's been a bit of a ooh, uh, everywhere video. But I am now nicotine up to high L. So I'm going to go and sit in a dark corner have plenty of liquid and fresh air. Thanks for watching guys. Next week we've got another tested review that I said I would review. So that's going down as sponsored. Don't forget to subscribe, ring the bell, comment down below, let us know what you think. Share and all that malarkey. And the most important thing you can always do is stay cloudy.